My need is great. I should be. This is no farm, but a major military encampment. of our moon. The size of this beast. The power behind it must be immense. It must have taken a full cow just to make this harness. These were no soldiers. Simple farmers. Bones ground up. Heads like smashed cabbages. The Iset, and Horus, and Serapis, and Anubis, and... Hurry, fool! Thank them later! Does anyone know Yusinem? Thank you, friend. While scouting the Roman forces, I foolishly fell into their hands. It's barbaric. They train elephants to battle with bloodlust and force them to kill hapless prisoners to harden them. Can you make it back from here? Of course. I will find Apollodorus and tell him.
Careful now. Hey, hold on. Hang on. I like the beacon. Commander tolerate Merit Mahat, not old hag. This area is off limits. Oh. 
at Memphis. That is where I will find the commander. Commander terrorizing Kayaka will be somewhere in the city, probably near a dock. Naked Yadet is dead. But what is this about Merit Ma'at's daughter? She might still be alive. I'm right here in Memphis. Greetings, Nebeth. Are you the commander's daughter? I am. May I help you? 
I am the bearer of strange news. But you must believe me. Your mother still lives. My mother? I was abandoned as a child. How could that be? Who are you? I have something here you should read. Take your time. Decide what to do. Your mother is at Keaka, to the south. She misses you. If you do return to her, tell her that her Magi friend fulfilled his heroic task. Oh! 
Go! I slaughter every last one of these dogs! Cover my back! Release me! I'll wet my blade with their blood! Get the bastard! No By a Kasiwa, aren't you? I've heard stories of the Medjai who crossed the desert. I am Theodorus, one of many who rebel against the Philakitai. Is that what landed you in this cage? Yes, a failed attack. I am hunting Daratos, a ruthless general of Ptolemy, with a hatred for Egyptians. A killer of mothers, and fathers, and children. I won't rest until his body is food for the worms. Would you lend your sword? Gladly. Your plight is true. Good joy. We will regroup with my men in Bacchus. Come along. How does a Greek find himself fighting an Egyptian cause? My father was Egyptian. My mother, Greek. Long ago, a day came when I discharged every ounce of Greek blood from my body and pledged to rid Egypt of men like Deratos. And we nearly did. We found his camp, but they had greater numbers. We were forced to disband. I was captured by a scouting group and beaten into giving up our retreat point. But you instead led them into a trap. Clever. I knew my brothers would rescue me, but I did not know the Medjai for Siwa would be among them too. You are rather celebrated amongst my group. We spent years tracking Ruchik, only to learn you made waste of him single-handedly. You would not call us your ally. Huh? But our goals seem to be aligned from time to time, don't they? You are not incorrect. We will take shelter here and wait for the right moment to strike. I will get briefed. Yeah. Ah, you. Ah! Work together. Oh, the something hard shelter here and wait for the right moment to strike I will get briefed dogs they've sent out scouting groups Theodoros Deratos has left the camp he's gone Deratos is gone neck he continues to elude me what should we do let's be smart we have an opportunity to claim two victories with one swift strike we need to wait for Deratos to return to camp I've learned his personal scribe has stayed behind in Karanis. We'll be targeted if we so much as take a piece nearby. You are unknown to them. Bring the scribe to us. He'll tell us what we need to know. How do I find him? At night, he rests within the courtyard. During the day, you can find him working around the temple or at the terrace overlooking the lake. He dresses elegantly, and due to our failed attack, now has guards in tow. He'll be hard to miss.
Must you follow me around everywhere? Describe himself. Drunk and dead to the world. Be long before he comes to. I need to bring him back to Theodorus. Maintain the peace, or I will. <laughs> that is him. Well done. We will find out what he knows. In the meantime, we must prepare our attack. Some of our brothers are stationed just west of Soknopayu. Meet with them and wait for my arrival. We will put an end to that Nekatirdet. A scribe who knows his way around Karanis. Deratos, where is he? That name means nothing to me. Don't think us fools! Please, stop! Then talk! We'll break your fingers! No! Then your wrists! No, don't! Where is Deratos? Talk! I can't! You can find the other rebels just west of Soknopayo. Talk! I can't!
You are either very brave or very foolish, setting foot back here. Nefertari, isn't it? A thousand blessings are long overdue. Mother! Bastard! Naked ear that! That was Rujek's wife. Did you expect anything less? This way, Bayek. And bring along your thousand blessings. You will need them. I feel bad for her. But it had to be done. You look well. Better than the last time I found you. Are you just better at killing now? Rujek was only the beginning. Yes, your hunt. The Heron. Where are you taking me? To make amends with Anubis. Amends? I do not know what you're talking about. <laughs> of course. How could you? You left the moment you woke. You know, all the natron for Egypt is collected here. We send it mostly to Memphis to cover the bodies of the dead. Look at me. No, you're unwell. Natron has other uses, though. I could use it to disinfect a wound. Or wash the stains of blood off my hands, for example. It looks better, Neb. I will have one of my aides bring something for the pain. And my brother? Recovering. He needs rest. You do not need to remind me. Why are so many of your people ailing? Because Anubis is displeased. Ever since you left, the torches by his shrines have lost their flame. We are no longer protected. From what? The wrath of Anubis? Whatever it is, we have suffered grave injuries trying to reignite them. Some have even vanished. It has become clear that Anubis demands your appeal and yours alone. I'll ignite the torches and end this curse, or omen, or whatever it is. You would do well to, if you ever hope to appease Anubis and gain my pardon. Sophia, give some frankincense to the men at the pool, would you? I don't need to tell you to be careful. There are three shrines. One to the south, one atop the natural well, and one inside the bent pyramid. You know your way to that one. One of the torches of Anubis should be here.
This torch has fallen over. Where's the head? Shrine. One of the torches must be here. There's no reason in it. Someone hung these. Predators here. Gatekeeper of the Duat, I honor your name. That was no simple task. There are other forces at work here. is broken. Was there a struggle? Someone fell, or was pushed. The Fatali was not exaggerating. This one died trying to light the torch. when the torch was tipped over.
jumps. This should do it. All I need to do now is light it. Gatekeeper of the Duat. I honor your name. Tomb of Sneferu. Someone has been here recently. It's blocked. There must be some way through. Tracks here are fresh. There must be another way inside the tomb.
Something must be behind here. be clear now. where my quest began. Gatekeeper of the Duat, I honor your name. That is the last touch. I should return to Nefertari. My life was undone here. Yet now there is a shrine, a memorial where none should be. Could this be for Rutjek? None could care for that snake that began this twisted quest, could they? Charms of Anubis. Someone has put these here, but why? Rujek Zaro. I marked his name off my list with this. 
Now it sits on the ground, forgotten. I'm gonna seal this room. The smell of the blood I spilled still lingers here. A mummified heron. For resurrection? No. Whoever did this must have known of Rudjek's place in the Order. A mummified heron. For resurrection? Rudjek does not deserve a tomb. But this is an insult. This tomb was made for a pharaoh. Whoever did this has defiled this place. Rudjek's mask. I barely remember what happened. Here. Mask. I barely remember what happened after I stabbed him. This room has told me all I need to know. This place was a beginning for me and an end for Rudjek. The arrow marked both of those things. After I stabbed that bastard, things went dark. When I came back to myself, Rudjek was dead. Rudjek's body should have been left to rot. He has been laid to rest with respect by someone who wanted him to enter the Duat prepared. Whoever buried him also left this heron mummy to honor Rudjek with his god's damned namesake in the afterlife. They then returned here to pay respect to Rudjek, if these candles are any indication. No matter what, I know Rudjek's heart was found lacking. That bastard suffers in the afterlife, no matter what was done here. I will be judged one day, but I do not regret my actions. The feather will always be lighter than my heart. Oh.